Hello, hello and welcome to another update video about silver. So I'll give you an Elliott Wave update now that the market has closed and now that we're ready here for the weekend. Um, I wish you a great start to the weekend. Um, yeah, I spent some time away from the charts, but you're still welcome to check out the videos here on this channel, of course. But yeah, what a performance by, by silver, not unexpected. It moved up higher in this third wave. We had a couple of uh, setups here in the recent one or two weeks. We had the orange support region, which did hold. And we had a breakout above the trend line for two setups. And now we are extending in the third wave to so the support area. I gave you in, I think it was yesterday's video, early yesterday, I made a video about silver. I gave you a support area that did hold. So there was no reason to assume we are breaking down or anything. In fact, it actually did overextend and moved even beyond my targets. So over delivered, I would say on this structure, but I still only see three wave move up. So there are a few things that are interesting. First of all, the price broke above this high, which is typically confirmation that, so this is a wave one high, this is a wave two low. And the idea would be that we're in a larger third wave somewhere. It's up there. <laughs> I think I might have did I take it out. Oh yeah, there it is. Um, to A, B. Okay, I need to label the whole thing. Maybe I'll do that for the weekend, uh, for the for the, for the the update next week. But the idea would be we are in a larger third wave. We should move towards the $40 area. However, however, um, looking at the micro patterns here, yeah, this here was a wave one in five waves, a pullback in three waves in a wave two here to the 6th of September low. Yeah, now the idea would be, you know, is this a wave one? again of the next rally well i can tell you something it's not it's looking nice and impulsive but i can tell you be on this side of caution and why because we are approaching the 100 percent extension this looks like a crystal clear abc structure okay so i want to share with you that i'm getting a bit concerned while it's moved up nicely Secure your profits if you entered in the support area. I mean, it's up to you if you do that, right? But it's just a general recommendation because the white count here, which allows for another test of the yellow support region is highly likely. That's where Fibonacci mathematics comes in and beats the just visual assessment of Elliott wave because what we need is the right proportion. Okay, so if we have a wave one here, which is bullish and a wave two, that's fine then normally we don't want the next move up, which would be the wave one. We don't want that get to the 100% extension, which I just showed you, right? So we're nearly there because this will then create a nice three wave structure, which is a crystal clear ABC structure. Um, I might explain that in, in Sunday's video. I'll probably do a video on Sunday when the market has opened um, in a little bit more detail because an ABC structure could just be white wave B after white wave A bottomed here, A, B, C. And if we now see an impulse down and break support, we, there is nothing bearish until we break support. But if we break support, this is something to watch for. And we could um, test that lower support area again. That's just something to be very much aware of. Now gold is, is moving up. So maybe silver isn't going this way. I just wanna warn about it just because I see that risk in the proportions here on this chart. Um, just a reminder, what is that 100% extension level? So we take the length of this move up, go to the low, to the recent low, 100% extension, uh, $31.69. Okay, it's a bit too long for another wave one, but we'll see, you know, I mean, I'm going to give you support areas along the way. At the moment, it seems to me as if this move up isn't entirely finished. Next week, I think we can watch for a pullback possibly here in wave four and then maybe one more high and then the decision moment will come. I will label that completely through for the for the Sunday update. Now I just want to give you a quick update of week wrap up. Um, idea is now we've got a very, so it's actually, you know, it's good to see we had five waves in wave one. Obviously we had a three wave pullback in wave two. So I can identify another five wave move here. So one, two, three, whoops, deleted. Didn't want to do that. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. 
So it's a full third wave, a bit extended even. And I've adjusted support now, which is next week's support, $29.46 to $30.23. And then we can get another high in wave five. A lot of people ask for a silver update. So yeah, I just want to give you a quick update. Um, won't probably have much time this weekend, um, but uh, yeah, I'll still try to give you another more thorough update, probably late on Sunday or Monday, early Monday. That's the update about silver. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also, make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Also, 